Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Before I get started with my Walmart video, I wanted to take a quick second to recap how my first week of YouTubing went. YouTube, wait, YouTubing, being on YouTube. <laughs> I don't know what the proper term is, but I'm gonna go with YouTubing. My first week of YouTubing was great. I told myself going in that I was going to at least try to get up one video a week as I do work full time. So I was like, one video, that's good. But then I quickly remembered how fast these deals move and I wanted to make sure we all score them. So I came out with four videos last week and that will probably be about the norm, three to four a week. I will put out content for you guys between Walmart, HEB and all the retailers trying to share the best deals that I find with you all. Um, during the week, you will find me in my car. Like I mentioned, I do work full time. So in the mornings, between lunch, in the evenings, I'm always on the go in my car. So that's where you will probably find my weekday videos or find me filming. But it is the weekend. And as you can see, I have a change of scenery here. I am in my boyfriend's kitchen about to head over to Walmart to complete my Ibotta April showers bonus. I need about three more, I think. Yeah, three more. To complete it so i'm gonna go see what they have i'm planning on doing a shop kick deal and then i'm always going to be looking to see what clearance they have so with that being said let's go see what they got so this end cap has a ton of hair dye markdown after a bit of scanning i was able to find three money maker deals using ibotta and paper coupons so let me show you what i found the first deal i found were the swash cop simply color boxes of hair dye they scanned for $6.40 on the Walmart app. There is also a $3.50 rebate on Ibotta with a limit of five. I also have a paper coupon here for $3 off one product, but the paper coupon limit is one. So I'm able to grab one box for a 10 cent money maker. Next, these L'Oreal Paris Magic Root Cover-Up Sprays are scanning for just $2.90. There is also a $2 rebate on the Ibotta app it is a limit one, however. There is also two different coupons that you could use on these products. The first one being a $5 off two, which would make these 80 cents out of pocket plus $2 back on Ibotta, making it a dollar and 20 cent money maker. Or you can use this $2 off one coupon, which will make it 90 cents out of pocket and get back $2 on Ibotta, making it a dollar and 10 cent money maker. This last hair dye deal can be mixed and matched a couple different ways, but this L'Oreal Paris Excellent Cream Hair Dye is ringing up for just $2, and there is a $2 rebate on the Ibotta app with a limit of one, making it free if you don't have any coupons. And this L'Oreal Paris Superior Preference Hair Dye is ringing up $3.50, and there's also a $2 rebate on the Ibotta app, which is a limit of one. But I have paper coupons as well, so the both of these total five dollars and fifty cents and i have a five dollar off one coupon so where i'm going to pay fifty cents out of pocket and get back four dollars two for the superior preference and two for the excellent hair dye again there is also the two dollar off coupon which would make this one free because it's just two off of one or this would make this a dollar fifty and get back the two dollars on ibotta as well but please keep in mind the coupon limits are one on both of these coupons. So what I'm gonna do, I'm grabbing one of each of those to use my $5 off of two. And then I am going to use just one of, grab one of those and use the $2 off one to stay within my coupon limits. So the next deal is gonna be a shop kick only deal. You want to grab one suave body wash for 97 cents. My store doesn't carry them for some reason. The cheapest one that they have is the dollar and 88 cent one. And you can still do this deal with that. It just won't be as big of a money maker. So I grabbed one at a dollar and 88 cents. And then for the second part of the deal, let me take you down here to the trial section. Trial size section. And you're gonna want to grab one suave shampoo for 97 cents as well. So this one will not scan as a match on Shopkick, but the deal will work. So together it's $2.85 for both this trial size shampoo and the body wash. And then you're gonna get back 800 kicks, which is $3.20 from Shopkick, which will make this a 35 cent money maker. But if you can find the 97 cent body wash, it will be over a dollar money maker deal. 
I shared this on Instagram last week, but just in case you missed it, these underwear are marked down to just 50 cents each in this tub. And these were also here last week, but they were not this cheap. It looks like most of these pantyhose are marked down to just 25 cents. So if you are in need of any of these items, definitely check your local Walmart. There are a ton of winter socks marked down here. Nothing in this section is over $2. My favorite find were these. Of course, they're not winter socks, but they did only ring up a dollar, so I'm definitely going to grab those. But these three packs were all $2, and so any three pack is pretty much just $2 besides this, and these single packs of knee-high socks are just $1. I'm currently in the girls section and it looks like they have some winter accessories clearancing out. These hats right here are normally $1.84 and they are on clearance for $0.25. Cents. And these gloves are originally $1.27 and they are also $0.25. Cents. These little girl hair accessories are normally $2.97 each, but they are all ringing up for just $1.00. This General Mills Sesame Street cereal is currently an Ibotta freebie. You will pay $3.64 out of pocket and Ibotta will give you back $3.64 as well. And then there is also a $0.75 cent rebate on coupons.com which will ultimately make this deal a $0.75 cent money maker. So before I talk about this, keep in mind this does not apply to every Walmart. but. For the most part, I'd say probably about 75% of Walmarts I go to have a clearance section for food. It can usually be found in like the candy aisle or the seasonal aisle on the end, closer to the meats, cheese, everything like that. So always make sure you check it because I can typically always find I bought a rebates here on the clearance food. So let's take a look what they got on this one. So down here, these have been here for a while. They're still marked at $2, but there is a $1.50 rebate on Ibotta for those. Let's see what else. There are some candies following the Easter clearance. These Welch's are only 25 cents. All this candy that's following the Easter is 75% off. That is following the Easter clearance. Let's see. And this right here is following Easter clearance. It is 87 cents and there is a 50 cent rebate on Ibotta. So always make sure to check your stores and see if they have a food clearance section. All right, y'all, I am all done shopping. This is everything that I have in my cart. I'm hoping to have enough moneymaker deals from Ibotta, Shopkick, and Coupons.com to cover the $4 that I have in clearance items. So that's all I'm grabbing today. Let's head to checkout. So this is my total for all the couponing items. I did not scan the socks with this transaction because remember in a previous video, I explained that I like to scan my clearance items on a separate receipt. So should that I have to return anything, it does not mess up any of my Ibotta deals or anything where they think that I returned one of their items. So this is my total before any coupons for the couponed items. So I had an issue with one coupon, which was the Swarovskoff one. It always gives me issues, but I was able to get my total down to $12.17 after. All right, y'all, I'm back home. So I wanted to go over my final totals with y'all. I bought four pairs of the clearance socks at a dollar each for a total of $4. And all my other items came out to $11.29 plus tax after all of my coupons. So together, I had a total of $15.29 plus tax out of pocket. I ended up getting back $13.14 on Ibotta. That does not include my $5 April showers bonus, so I will not be including that in my totals here. I got back $3.20 from Shopkick, and I got back $0.40 cents from Fetch Rewards. Some of y'all may get back more on Fetch Rewards for that cereal, but my offer did not have the 1,200-point offer, so I only got back $0.40. Cents. Anyways, all my rebates combined was $16.74. So after it's all said and done, my entire haul was a $1.45 moneymaker haul. Again, that does not include the $5 bonus that I got for the April showers bonus on Ibotta. So I'm really pleased with how that turned out. Most of it was on the fly and just seeing what they had on clearance, but I'm really thankful for that clearance hair dye because that is ultimately where I got a lot of the moneymaker deals to help cover the socks. 
But that's all I have for you guys today. I want to thank you all for tuning in and going shopping at Walmart with me. If you haven't yet, please subscribe. I love having you all here and sharing all of my deals and finds with y'all. And I cannot wait to see you all in my next video. Have a good one.